Hi, I'm Joost and I'm here with the Zensi Lab Quick Keys and this is a real risk saver for me for my video editing. So this saves me a lot of time editing in Final Cut Pro, but of course you can use this for any kind of uh, software or even browsing because you can set your own custom short keys here. So any short key you can add to this so you can change brush sizes or zoom in, zoom out, that sort of thing. It's all easily done from within this app. Now I just have this next to my computer when I'm editing so I can quickly use the dial or use the buttons here to make the necessary changes while I'm doing this. And this really saves my wrist because you don't need to use the command and an extra key every time I need to adjust the setting or cut and paste in my timeline. Connect this to the USB port. Okay, so you can see the battery life here as well in the Accenti Labs, my quick keys. So you can see all the keys here in different modes. Undo, redo, copy, paste, shift, command, option, and space. And these are also the things that are mentioned here on the display. And now I can create different sets here. This is set A, so let's change that. Shortcut name is shift and keystroke keys. You can add special functions and everything. And for now I'm going to call it cut. And let's clear this. And by using the command key and keeping it down, it adds a plus. Command plus B, that's cut. And I'll change this one as well, because I also do a lot of changing the video to a picture, uh, because I do a lot of stop motion or let's say speed build of Legos. <laughs> So I need to keep that down and that's option plus F. So that will allow me to add a picture of the timeline right in there. And now my display says cut and pick. So I can remember those. Okay, so you can change all these buttons, which is pretty cool. And now I should be able to cut with just the push of a button here. So let's look at that. I press cut here and then it will cut my timeline right over there. And then I'll press the pick button and it will add a little picture in there instead of the actual video. So that will help me a lot and <laughs> save my wrist a lot of trouble. Of course, I can also quickly undo these, which is one of the standard settings on the quick keys. Now you can have different sets here, so you can enable those as well. I can also very easily take this with me because you can use it wirelessly with the supplied dongle and it has a very sturdy carry case, so I can just throw this in my bag and not worry about it. So I really recommend this one for anyone looking for a small extra set of keys that it's programmable. And I love the fact that it has a display so you can see what you're doing.